Welcome to this special edition episode of Talking Shirts. I'm Mike from Hulk Car Shirts, and today we're going to take a look at the 2019 Captain's Run Tee. So, in 2019, Tim Sheens was the head coach, and the shirt that you can see here was issued to Tim Sheens for that season. Tim was sponsored by the 360 Chartered Accountants, and it also had his initials TS. He applied to the shirt. So Captain's Run, uh, which is a training session that takes day, takes place the day before game day. It's kind of that last session, that last run, led by the captain, ready for the game prep for that following day. Now, most clubs have these shirts, and these ones were also made available to purchase from the club shop. So it's basically just a training tee. Got a little bit of ventilated fabric down the side. Obviously, it's all white, and then we've kind of got what, Looks like paint, splatter marks. We did a lot along those lines in 2018, 2019 times with some advertising and promotional campaigns. This one does have a mark across the front here. Not quite sure what that is, um, but everything on here is dye sublimated. The idea behind that is to make it quite lightweight and make it quite easy for training. Now, the reason why I'm showing you this shirt, because this isn't the shirt that I'm showing you today, the reason why I'm showing you this shirt is just so that you can see the comparable differences when I take it off the mannequin. So now what I've done is I've taken this off here and you can now see that this is the actual playing captain's run tee. I say playing because it was it was never played in. It wasn't a, a, a match worn shirt, shall we say, uh, or even a player issue shirt as such for a game. Now, the material of this is very different to that that I've just shown you. This is now made out of this little pin, the pinhole material that we see across the plain shirts that I've got up here and that we've got down here. So, basically, what happened was Tim Sheens wanted the, the players to play or to warm up and do the captain's run in a plain style shirt. Now, these are obviously a lot more restrictive than what you would expect um, from the T-shirt that I've just shown you. The shirt I've just took off the mannequin was a 2XL. This is an extra large. So there's one size difference between this one that is quite nicely snug fit into the mannequin and the one that was quite big and baggy. Now, for whatever reason, it wasn't liked and the players didn't enjoy wearing that captain's run tee in this form. We've got a GPS tracker in the back. I'll pop a picture up so you can see that one there. We've got more of a reinforced stitching around the neck. And the neck there is obviously that a little bit more restrictive. The side panelling material is the only part of it that is actually quite stretchy. So there's not really that much give in the rest of it. And we've also got on the front here, the heat applied grip patch in the big shape of an X, which was quite common with X blades. Now, so basically, the club had quite a few of these shirts hanging around. The players weren't enjoying wearing them for the captain's run, so that didn't last for very long. However, in 2019, Ben Parker was setting up the, the women's team as part of the Community Trust at Hull KR, and they got, these shirts then got given to Ben and the women's team to wear during the 2019 and then the beginning of the 2020 seasons. So I'll pop some pictures up. Uh, that you can see of the girls wearing this shirt in match action. And it's really good to know that these shirts then didn't go to waste. The back is pretty plain. It's got the same design that we've got on the front. There is no name, there is no number. We've got the x Blades logo. There is pretty much zero sponsorship going on, apart from the Wilberforce College, which has been sublimated onto either side. So these made some really good playing shirts for the women's team. Now, it's really good to see that A, something didn't go to waste, but B, it probably got put to better use in the long term by being used by, by the ladies than it would have done from the lads doing a captain's run with these shirts. During the, the, the 2021 stroke 2022 off season, that, that period in the middle, the decision was made to move the women's team away from the community trust and more in line with the club and the remit that they that they possess. That's a really good move for the women's team to be able to be sort of club recognised 
um, and in line with with the first team and the learning disability and everything else that kind of comes under that Hull KR umbrella. In 2022, they've actually announced that they've got their own bespoke shirt. So again, I'll pop another picture up for you here. So this style is the, it's the same as the 2022 men's shirt. However, you'll see that it didn't have a sponsor on the front and they've actually been now sponsored by the Blood Clinic uh, by Atropia. So that's really good for the women's team to have a, a unique sponsor across the front of their shirt. It's really good for, for those guys to be able to, to make their own sort of history and legacy um, and especially from a kit perspective as well. So it'll be quite interesting to see if I can possibly add one of those into my collection at the end of the season to really kind of add another layer to the collection that is Hulk AR shirts. Um, I'd just like to go on record to thank Ben Parker. Uh, ben was the one that passed one of these shirts on to me, so I really do appreciate that, Ben, because it's a little piece of, of history and there's a story behind it that probably wouldn't have been been told if Ben hadn't have, have been able to pass the shirt on to me and then tell me the story behind it. So Ben, much appreciated, mate. I really do, I really do thank you very much for that one. So yeah, that's been this special edition of Talking Shirts. Hope you've enjoyed seeing something a little bit different to the, the usual. Uh, but fear not, normal service will be resumed for episode 60, which I'll be back with in another couple of weeks. Um, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And also, if you could just check out on social media, your followers mean the world to me. I'm really trying to build up a really strong network um, over on my social media channels. And I'm putting out sort of weekly content on there. So yeah, if you would check that out, then I would greatly appreciate that too. Thank you very much for watching this special edition of Talking Shirts. See you all soon and bye for now.